Enjoying fairly mild weather out there this afternoon, but some changes are on the way. First alert to this next cold front getting ready to swing through. That's going to bring us a quick drop in temperatures as we get out for your Tuesday. For now, still sitting under sunny skies, plenty of warmth to go around for the remainder of your Monday evening. So let's take you through the hour by hour forecast. As we jump ahead here through the next few hours, the cloud cover starts to build, but we really begin to notice that overcast weather builds Building in as you're getting ready to head out the door Tuesday morning. Right around 8 a.m., you'll probably notice a bit of cloud cover working into the metro. Fairly cloudy already out across most of eastern Nebraska. Still some sunshine, though, ongoing out over western Iowa to get your day started. As we move through the day, though, quick quickly uh, seeing those clouds fill in and we're going to be very cool underneath that high temperatures are going to stay in the 30s. The good news is behind this front. We don't have much wind, but it's going to be chilly all on its own. High temperatures staying in the mid to upper 30s, 36 degrees around the metro and you'll notice underneath the cloud cover out to the northwest starting around three, bringing in the potential for some isolated snow showers. These are going to track through during the afternoon to evening. Most consistent snow staying off to the north and northeast of the metro by 8 p.m. starting to work through portions of western Iowa where we have more consistent snow cover. This could bring us the potential for maybe an isolated trace to under a half an inch possible north of the metro, but I would say for most this is not going to be a huge issue. The cold that's going to be the main concern through the day by midnight heading into early Wednesday or falling back into the 20s and that chill will linger on into Wednesday morning as skies clear and we drop once again back down into the 20s for tomorrow. Very cold start before those clouds start to build in. Temperatures will fall quickly should reach a low of 22 by 8 a.m. 7 a.m. Starting the day off at 23 by 3 or reaching for that high of 36 chilly day and we can't rule out a snow shower during in the afternoon to evening, wrapping up after about 8 p.m. as we fall back down into the low 30s. Plan for a high of 36 around the metro, 37 in Harlan, 38 around Wahoo, maybe a couple of low 40s down to the southwest, but for most of us, it's going to be a chilly day. Changes are coming, though. Once we get past that chilly Tuesday, we have this little low pressure system here that's going to kick out the cold. We're going to watch that move down to our south through the weekend. Very little impact there, and then a really stable pattern building in. Ridge of high pressure moves in starting off next work week, and that is going to stay in place for quite a while. This is a drier pattern, a warmer pattern. So as we approach Christmas, only two weeks away, relatively mild and dry forecast. Highs are back to the 50s by Thursday and Friday, staying in the mid to upper 40s through the weekend. Overall dry, mild pattern through the rest of the 10 day forecast. You can stay on top of that by downloading our six first alert weather app. You can find that free in the app store. Not much to look ahead to there on the extended <laughs> outlook. The silver lining is the weather's not going to get in your way if you have plans to maybe do some holiday shopping, but I wouldn't be planning for a white Christmas. Wow, oh, man, there it is. But not a lot to complain about <laughs> no, either. Yeah. You know, it could be a lot worse. It could be. It really could be. Emily, thank you.